We speak so much about guarding our eyes. Why are these eyes so important? Why not other parts of our body? What is it about the eyes? Is there something that we really want to see that we're guarding our eyes for, that we're saving our eyes for? And indeed, there is something very important that we hope to see. Three times a day, we're mispala, we pray. We say, Rebun Yishlalem. We would like to see your return to Yerushalayim and the building of the Beis HaMikdash. And we know not everyone has and will merit to see the rebuilding of the third Beis HaMikdash. So who's going to see it? The Gemara says Masech Makos on the Pasuk in Yeshaya, Ve'oitzem einav meira'ois bera. One who withholds his eyes from looking at something improper, says the Gemara, this is someone who doesn't gaze at something inappropriate. And what will the reward be? The Gemara says, we'll look at the next part of the Pasuk. This individual will dwell on high. What exactly is this reward that this person will dwell on high? The Sefer Taharois HaKodesh explains that we need to go to the next words of the Pasuk. The Pasuk continues, Mitsudois Silaim Misgabai. A tower and a fortress will be his protection. What exactly is this reward? Says the Targum, Beis Mikdisha Tizba Nafshe. This individual will be sated by seeing the third Beis Hamikdash. So if you want to know why it's so important to guard your eyes, are we saving it for some really momentous occasion? Indeed we are. For the most momentous occasion in history. Those who are among the great Kehila community of those who guard their eyes will be privileged to the great vision of the rebuilding of the third Beis HaMikdash. So don't get down when you're faced with a temptation. Hashem is giving you the opportunity to purchase with your actions a front row seat to the greatest show in history, the rebuilding of the third base on Mikdash. Make sure you get a good ticket. Bracha v'hatzlachah.